Yes. Can I help you with something? Uh, did your friends send you over here? Or did you think that I would enjoy being talked to like that? Young one, I'm much older than you, and I've garnered no reason for you to prance up to me acting like a cocky child. Sit. Good. You know, something you learn a lot over the years is that you don't have to prove anything to anybody. It's not necessary. And it seems to me that you were trying to prove something to your friends. Whatever that may be. Your friends are not a good influence on you. I can tell by looking at you that you aren't that type of person. So why are you bending to that? Do you honestly think you're worth that little? <laughs> Do you understand what I am saying to you? I don't want a yeah. I want a yes ma'am. Good. Now, why don't you join me here for a while? I'm a tad lonely and would love some company. I promise I won't scold you the whole time. There's really no reason for it. You look a little embarrassed. <laughs> Don't be silly. Sit. They could care less. Look. They've already gone back to talking amongst themselves. They aren't paying you any attention. I can guarantee you I'm not bad company. I'm just a bit serious, that's all. Mm. <sighs> Have you tried this before? coffee here is quite exquisite. Most people usually get the tea, but I just can't pass up something that is just so good. Usually they don't have things like this around. So, what are your hobbies, young one? Hmm. I'm going to guess, um, those friends decided most of those for you. <laughs> I can just tell. Tell me, what are your real hobbies? I know for a fact that you do not do most of those things. And that's just me looking into you. Hmm. Those sound a lot more like something you'd be into. And they're much more unique and enjoyable. Hmm. So, why are you in here? 
your friends invite you? Or did you hear them talking about it, ask if you could come, and, and then they make fun of you? <laughs> I guess you could say that I just read people, and your eyes say so much about your character. Young one, are you an adult? That's good to know. Oh, no reason. It's nothing you need to worry about. Not yet, at least. I heard you say something about plants earlier. Do you know by any chance what a jade plant is? It's a type of succulent. They're quite interesting, have thick leaves, grow pretty sturdy, and they're not extremely fickle as a plant. You just have to take care of it. The reason I'm bringing this up is because I don't think that you are taking care of yourself. And I am now comparing you to a jade plant. If you don't take care of them, they die, wither, or get into very bad and poor condition for, you know, a living thing. I think that you need to take care of yourself. First step in doing that would be getting rid of those fake friends. I do enjoy gardening, actually. It's very calming. Young one. What, in your opinion, is a good day? Is it a day where you can sit alone and enjoy the little things and not have to worry about anybody else or anything in the world? Or is it trying to be somebody you aren't and failing to impress people around you forcing yourself into the, um, a public environment and be isolated while you're next to people you call friends I'm still kind of getting at you about that, aren't I? My apologies. I can tell you're becoming uncomfortable. How about this? Have you been to the waterfalls next to Ergale? You haven't? Well, how about you meet me there at midnight tonight? It'd be an interesting meetup. Trust me, it's quite beautiful there. You wouldn't regret going. I mean, one of the reasons I'm inviting you is because I think you need to enjoy things a little bit more. Oh, have you tried this pie yet? Here, have some. I can't eat it all. I only took a bite out of it. Trust me, I wouldn't feed you something if I had went in for seconds. There's an extra um, spoon right there that I never used. I used my fork, but it's fine. You don't need a fork all the time for pie.
it's peach. It's delicious. Have you ever dated somebody? Young one. A few people. <laughs> Young one. If I may. I'd like to teach you how to properly treat a woman. If you'll give me the chance. It won't be like a normal relationship. And you can always tell me what you're uncomfortable with. But I'd like to teach you a little bit more on manners and a few other things so that you know how to pamper the girl of your dreams. Whoever that may become. Well, there are many different ways to pamper and some of the ones I have in mind may not be something you'd want to do in public, but they'd be fun. Trust me. I told you the pie was good. I make things at home. But every once in a while I like to come over here and enjoy a nice cup of coffee and some pie, but today it didn't seem as... Mm. It didn't seem as, um, appealing. <laughs> oh no. It wasn't you that did that. It's some other things in my life. Things I usually have to deal with and get over with. It's normal. Uh, when you get older, you have a lot more problems or more of certain ones. Oh, I didn't realize how late it was getting. Don't forget, meet me at the waterfalls at midnight. I'll be there. Oh, and bring something to swim in. You'll need it. Bye, love. Hey, you reached the end of the video. Thank you for staying all the way till the end. And if you enjoyed this content, Please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. The Elysia.